Hi, this is Derek, and today, welcome to our special show on uh, UFOs and uh, and what the, what's the other thing they call it? We forget, but uh, for us, it's UFOs, and uh, they must be extraterrestrials. All right, the first thing we're going to look at are those special crop circles. Come over here and look at it. As you can see, there are two crop circles. There's a smaller one over here and a bigger one over there. This smaller one is about 10 inches circumference. This must be human made, right? Like some human, like, you know, made it. And this one is bigger. This one is about 15 inches in circumference. This cannot have been made by humans. And we know that for a fact. Now you see this tree, now, why is this tree over there? Like there's no trees here. Over there, there are trees, but they don't really count. But why is there a tree over here? You have, to, you have to ask yourself and wonder, why is this tree like flat here? You see, it's flat and nobody cut the tree. So it can't be done by a human. So you have to wonder, like somebody that must have come from another like planet or universe, it must be extraterrestrial. Now this is a real, real special one. Like supposedly they didn't had invented the wheel. But here it is. There's a wheel. Look. You can see it was painted. But paint didn't exist till 1800s. In the 1800s. So this cannot be human paint. This must be extraterrestrial paint. See now this guy from South America in 500 BC found this special fountain of youth and the story is that he thought that pumping this water would give him like some kind of eternal life you know so the idea is that you would take the handle here and they would use copper chisels and hit it real hard and then pump it and now water would come but the water would be extraterrestrial so this is river Titicacapu right there and this river used to come down from China, right? You go all the way down here and all these stones over there, you know, they weren't there before. They, they had to bring those stones all the way from the mound over there, carry them across the hill, across the river, you know, with, with no wheel and no tools. So. You have to ask yourself and wonder, they must have some help from extraterrestrials. So I, I forgot to tell you, I know I, I'm going to tell you a little bit about myself. Like my parents were actually born in France, but I lived in America. So now, as you can see, this looks like a birdhouse, right? Like it has a little hole, has a roof and everything. But those little houses used to be giant. And they used to be built by giant people. That's what the legend says. Giant people. And we know that for a fact. And they build these little bird houses. And what would they do? The bird would come in. And there would be like a snake inside. And they would eat the bird. You know, you have to ask yourself. Like these people must have thought in a different way. They must have thought like extraterrestrials. So as you can see, I traveled in all kinds of different like very very strange countries like uh, United States Canada you know places like that where people like just don't know like what's going on like they think that they see some things that they think that they're drones stuff like that and submarines but you have to know by now like if you really know for a fact that all this stuff must be extraterrestrials hi I'm Derek, and welcome to our show today. And uh, today we're gonna talking uh, be talking about uh, giant uh, blocks of stones. Uh, there's, as you know, there's giant blocks of stones all around the world. There's giant blocks of stones everywhere, and uh, they don't know, like actually, like. Okay, ta 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 cut. Hi, I'm uh, I'm Derek, and uh, no, it's Bobo. Oh, come on. <laughs> Hi, this is Derek uh, on the special UFO show. And today we're going to show that you the first thing we're going to look at today is this special crop circle right there. If you come a little closer, 
you can see that there's a smaller one right over there and its circumference is about 10 inches wide this is possibly done by by human but this one here is about 15 inch circumference and this must be extraterrestrials